Okay, so this is going to be a review of the Flying Bear P905. Uh, single E, dual Z, auto leveling. Uh, it's a great little device. Uh, I had a little issue with the shipping, a little, a little longer than it should have been, but hey, it's coming from China. <laughs> and um, you know what? took me about 12 hours to build because I went really really slowly and I uh, made sure like re verified everything like three times and um, had a few little little issues the instructions aren't totally clear and they get thin at the end um, inverted the uh, X and Y axis and no big deal <laughs> change the wires back and uh, it's printing I've been printing a few test prints, like this vase here, a little code they, they provide with the printer. And I also printed a little coin, I don't have it with me right here. A, a test coin that was really like over pushing the printer. A bit of, uh, well, see there's no uh, cooling fan for uh, the extruded filament. Uh, on the, uh, Facebook group though there's already uh, a model for it so I'll be printing it pretty soon and installing it uh, it's been printing really 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 good I, I built it up uh, I had a little issue with one of the z-axis just turned one of the rod a bit and it's perfectly fine now oiled it up a bit and uh, yeah I'm really surprised. I don't know why people are complaining uh, that uh, Chinese printers aren't good or whatever. This is top notch. I love it. Uh, good price. If you want a pre built printer, don't go that route. If you want to learn about your printer and know how it works, this is the thing you want. Because you'll build it from A to Z every nuts and bolts and you know what it's been a real pleasure uh, every part seems of great quality it's all metal I won't knock on it because it's printing but yeah it, it is stable and um, yeah the only plastic plexiglass parts are the holders the, for the, the boards the controller and uh, the screen which isn't a big deal at all uh, yeah I don't know what else to say just uh, if you're interested try it out it's a good printer it's worth it I'm it's my first printer I never built a 3d printer before never used one before uh, I did spend a bit of time online learning about 3D printers, which I recommend to anyone anyone interested before buying one, because you might be surprised of uh, limitations if you think it will print uh, anything. You know, it prints plastic. Uh, well, some wood filament, some flexible filament, and apparently some translucent filament. I'm I'm gonna have some fun exploring. Uh, they provide. You know, I don't know how much is that, probably about around 200, 250 grams of plastic. Um, more than I thought it would, would be, like I've been able to do a, a few test prints and I'm still printing with it. I'll need to buy a soon, buy some more quite soon though, because I'm pretty sure I'll be printing a lot more. Um, if you have any question about the printer, just ask down below. I'll be really happy to reply. Um, yeah, I'm getting crazy, 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 cause, uh, you know what? It's a 3D printer. I paid 320 bucks for it, Canadian, delivered to my home. Should have been about one, two weeks, been three and a half weeks about, but, you know, it's not that long. Uh... You know, some people will take more time than that just to build it. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, it's a crazy thing, crazy experience. It's been fun. It's still fun. 
Oh, I need to fine tune a few settings and like the extrusion rate, temperature, and stuff like that. But straight out of the box like that, it's printing, and it's printing good, like good. You know, there's a, a few. I don't know if you can see now. You probably can. Like a few little. Oh yeah, a few little holes in the bottom there. So it's been under extruding a bit. Base mode. Ah. Uh, but yeah, look at that, a little cut. Yeah. So, any question? Ask him. I do recommend Flying Bear. They did offer me fifty bucks for a for putting a video online about on YouTube and Facebook. I was about to put one anyway, so it's not what changed my mind, you know. <laughs> I'm not giving them that good of a review uh, because uh, they're paying me or they even said if I get 2,000 views, which I do really doubt it within two months, uh, I will get the printer free. I really doubt I don't have that much viewers. <laughs> um, but you know what? I loved it. it there's been a few issues. I, uh, no, it's, a, it's a learning experience. There's a learning curve. Uh, I had one one issue that was about the quality of the printer. It's the um, induction sensor. Too sensitive. Turned it on the printer, the light wasn't on on it. The bed moved up. It detected the bed. Started the bed started going down. It kept detecting something. Uh, the metal plate right behind the sensor was probably too close to the sensor, but just like not enough to detect it by itself but if something else triggered it it would stick on I placed uh, about four layers of cardboard between the sensor and its metal backing plate and now it works super fine so just use a bit of your head uh, take your time and you're gonna have a super nice printer yeah flying bear p905 I love it <laughs>